nature thrives on balance, with ecosystems depending on intricate relationships between species, environments, and food chains. This delicate equilibrium ensures that no single organism dominates, allowing all species to coexist harmoniously. However, when one species grows unchecked, this balance collapses, triggering a cascade of disruptions that ripple through entire habitats. Overabundant species, those that multiply excessively due to human interference, climate shifts, or the introduction of invasive organisms, pose a growing global threat. They disrupt native populations, overconsume resources, and destabilize ecosystems that have evolved over millennia. Invasive organisms often outcompete native species for food and territory, leading to dwindling biodiversity. Climate changes can amplify the problem, creating favorable conditions for certain species to thrive while others struggle to survive. Human activities, such as habitat destruction and overfishing, further exacerbate these imbalances, leaving ecosystems vulnerable and fragile. From frogs taking over backyards to lionfish devastating coral reefs, these species wreak havoc, leaving ecological destruction in their wake. Let's dive into some of the most dramatic examples of this phenomenon and explore the broader consequences. In 2022, a TikTok user from the UK gained viral fame by creating what he called the largest frog army in history. Claiming to have collected 1.4 million frog eggs from a pond near his home, he hatched them in a backyard pool and released them into the wild. The internet marveled at this spectacle, showering his videos with millions of likes and views. But ecologists saw it as a disaster in the making. Such a massive influx of frogs appended the local ecosystem. The frogs, unable to find enough food, began competing fiercely, leading to starvation and weakening the population. Dense frog populations also became breeding grounds for diseases that could spread to native amphibians. On top of that, predators like foxes and rodents thrived on the sudden abundance of frogs, leading to secondary imbalances. The damage didn't stop there. A decline in insect populations followed, disrupting pollination and plant growth. As the frogs spread to neighboring areas, their impact cascaded across the ecosystem. While some viewers dismissed the story as a stunt, the consequences of such actions, if real, highlight the dangers of tampering with nature's delicate balance. What do you think? Should stunts like this face stricter penalties to prevent ecological harm? Yes or no, let us know in the comments section. Not long after the frog fiasco, another TikTok user sparked controversy by releasing 250,000 ladybugs in New York City's Central Park. Motivated by the viral appeal of orchestrating a ladybug invasion, the individual purchased the insects online and released them after his post garnered an overwhelming number of likes. While the spectacle lacked the chaos of the frog incident, it ignited serious environmental concerns. Releasing such a large number of non-native ladybugs disrupted the natural balance, creating food shortages for both the introduced insects and native species that rely on similar resources. This sudden influx also placed significant pressure on local ecosystems, as some of the ladybugs outcompete native varieties, further destabilizing biodiversity. The ecological consequences were compounded by the social backlash. Conservationists warned that such actions, while seemingly harmless or entertaining, could have long-term repercussions on local wildlife. The event highlighted the growing issue of individuals leveraging social media influence to carry out environmentally reckless stunts without understanding their broader implications. The aftermath was severe. The user faced a $350,000 lawsuit for environmental terrorism, prompting him to flee the country to evade legal consequences. The incident became a stark reminder of how viral fame, combined with a lack of ecological awareness, can lead to far-reaching and damaging outcomes. It left many questioning the accountability of social media-driven behavior and its impact on the natural world. Locusts have long been a symbol of ecological devastation. These insects, typically solitary and harmless, undergo a dramatic transformation when conditions align in their favor. Excessive rainfall not only creates lush feeding grounds but also triggers a population boom. What follows is the formation of colossal swarms capable of traveling thousands of miles and consuming nearly everything in their path. In their heightened state, referred to by scientists as chomp mode, locusts become relentless agents of destruction. Between 2003 and 2005, 
West Africa suffered one of the most catastrophic locust invasions on record. Swarms as vast as entire cities decimated crops across 22 countries, obliterating over 80% of agricultural output. The ensuing famine left millions without sustenance, while the disruption to ecosystems was profound and far-reaching. Local biodiversity was appended as these voracious swarms consumed vegetation indiscriminately, destabilizing entire food chains and further impoverishing fragile environments. Locust swarms are a glaring example of how swiftly ecological balance can spiral out of control. Heavy rainfall fuels an explosion in reproduction, and overcrowding triggers profound behavioral and physiological shifts. These seemingly small changes morph a benign species into a catastrophic force, underscoring the fragility of ecosystems and the devastating ripple effects caused by overabundance. In 2023, Nevada witnessed a Mormon cricket invasion that turned the state into a scene straight out of a horror movie. After a wet winter and a soggy spring, tens of thousands of crickets hatched and began migrating en masse. The infestation hit the small town of Elko particularly hard, with crickets swarming streets, devouring vegetation, and leaving behind a stench of decay. The crickets not only stripped the land of greenery but also polluted water supplies as their decaying bodies washed into streams and rivers. This outbreak underscores how environmental changes can fuel overabundance. Mormon crickets, which often remain dormant for years, can experience a surge in numbers under favorable conditions, leading to ecological havoc. The destruction they inflict extends beyond mere crop damage, causing widespread soil erosion, deteriorating water quality, and severely disrupting ecosystems. These cascading effects underscore how overabundant species can destabilize delicate environmental balances, leaving long-term scars on affected areas. With increasing climate fluctuations, such invasions may become more frequent, posing significant risks to both natural landscapes and human livelihoods. The question remains, how prepared are we to mitigate these ecological disasters before they escalate further? Lionfish, native to the Indo-Pacific, have become a nightmare for marine ecosystems in the Atlantic and Caribbean. Their rapid reproduction, up to 2 million eggs per year, and lack of natural predators in these waters have allowed them to dominate coral reefs. Lionfish devour native fish species at alarming rates, reducing biodiversity and disrupting food chains. In some areas, young reef fish populations have declined by 80% within weeks of a lionfish invasion. Efforts to control lionfish populations include promoting them as a sustainable seafood option. However, their rapid reproduction makes eradication nearly impossible. The ecological impact of this invasive species is staggering, particularly given its origin. Scientists attribute the Atlantic invasion to a mere three individuals, underscoring the exponential consequences of introducing non-native species into fragile ecosystems. Today, millions of lionfish occupy vast marine territories, reshaping underwater landscapes and demonstrating how a single invasive species can spiral into a devastating ecological imbalance. If you're fascinated by how overabundant species are disrupting ecosystems, don't forget to like, share, and comment below which species impact surprised you the most. Canada geese, once endangered, have rebounded so dramatically that they are now considered overabundant. Conservation efforts and urbanization have created ideal conditions for their population to explode. Today, there are over 4 million Canada geese in the United States alone, with numbers growing by 10% annually. These birds cause significant ecological damage. By overgrazing, they strip landscapes of vegetation, leaving barren ground that's difficult to restore. Their droppings pollute water bodies, harming aquatic life and spreading harmful bacteria. One goose produces over 1,450 pounds of waste annually. Their droppings pollute water bodies, introducing harmful bacteria and depleting oxygen levels, which severely impacts aquatic life and water quality. The species' long lifespan of up to 24 years amplifies these issues, with their presence creating long-term ecological challenges. As habitats are degraded, efforts to restore them could span decades, requiring immense resources and sustained interventions. Canada geese exemplify how conservation measures, while well-intentioned, can sometimes spiral into ecological dilemmas, revealing the delicate balance required to manage thriving populations without compromising ecosystem health. Overabundant species are a pressing global issue, 
increasingly disrupting delicate ecosystems and creating cascading challenges. Wild boars in Europe, with their rapidly expanding populations, are devastating agricultural lands and natural forests. Their relentless rooting behavior destroys native vegetation, threatening biodiversity and exacerbating soil erosion. Moreover, they are vectors for diseases like African swine fever, jeopardizing both wildlife and domestic livestock industries. In North America, invasive Asian carp have colonized waterways, dominating aquatic ecosystems by outcompeting native fish for food and habitat. Their explosive population growth disrupts commercial and recreational fishing, posing economic challenges to local communities. Additionally, their startling leaping behavior has caused numerous boating accidents, endangering human safety. Deer populations, fueled by suburban sprawl and declining predator numbers, are another ecological imbalance. Overbrowsing by deer depletes young tree saplings, hindering forest regeneration and altering the habitat for other species. These overpopulated herds also increase the risk of vehicle collisions, leading to significant human and financial costs. Each of these scenarios highlights how unchecked population growth in certain species destabilizes ecosystems, damages economies, and threatens human livelihoods. Addressing these challenges requires proactive measures, including population control strategies, habitat management, and stricter policies on invasive species. Without intervention, the consequences will undoubtedly escalate, leaving lasting scars on global ecosystems. But the question remains, how do we prevent and manage these situations before they spiral out of control? Addressing overabundant species requires coordinated and multifaceted efforts. Education is pivotal in cultivating a deeper understanding of how tampering with nature's balance leads to unintended ecological disruptions. By promoting awareness, communities can adopt proactive measures to mitigate the proliferation of invasive and overabundant species. Governments must implement and enforce stringent policies to restrict the introduction and spread of these organisms, ensuring that ecosystems remain resilient and diverse. Restoration projects are equally critical as they help revive damaged habitats and restore the natural equilibrium of ecosystems. Innovative approaches, such as promoting the consumption of certain invasive species like lionfish, can turn ecological threats into economic opportunities, incentivizing active population management. Encouraging industries and local communities to participate in these efforts can amplify their effectiveness. The challenge lies in finding harmony between human needs and ecological health. Overabundance is often a direct consequence of human activities, including habitat alteration and climate change, which create imbalances favoring certain species. However, humanity also possesses the tools and knowledge to reverse these trends. Through collaboration among policymakers, scientists, and citizens, effective solutions can be developed to address this pressing issue. How can we strike this delicate balance? Share your insights and contribute to a vital conversation on safeguarding our planet's ecosystems. The rise of overabundant species serves as a stark reminder of the fragility of ecosystems. These species, often driven by human activity or environmental shifts, disrupt delicate ecological balances, leading to widespread consequences. From invasive swarms to unnatural population booms encouraged by viral trends, Every case underscores the intricate web of life and the devastating outcomes when its equilibrium is upset. Coral reefs, essential to marine biodiversity, vanish under relentless pressure from overabundant species. Forests lose their native inhabitants, and agricultural lands suffer as opportunistic invaders overtake crops, leaving entire communities grappling with economic hardships. The impact isn't confined to nature alone. Local biodiversity supports millions of livelihoods, and its disruption triggers cascading effects that threaten food security and social stability. By understanding the causes and consequences of this phenomenon, we can pave the way for meaningful solutions. This requires fostering awareness and adopting sustainable practices to restore harmony between humans and the natural world. It is essential to act swiftly and collectively. Preserving the planet's ecosystems is not just about safeguarding wildlife, but also ensuring a future where human progress and nature coexist. Together, we can work toward a world where biodiversity flourishes and communities thrive. Stay curious, stay informed, and be part of the change.
Don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating stories about the natural world and ways we can protect it together.